Welcome to the French Drain Man channel. I'm Robert Sherwood, and I want to explain to you how blind inlets in our systems work. We do a burrito wrapped system, and we have a special fabric that we have double punched for a high flow rate, but it works its best once the sod the roots have actually grown into the holes in the fabric so that the water could run through the sod, down the root. Both capillary action and gravity create a, an incredible pathway for the water to drain from the surface of your yard with a burrito-wrapped system. Now, when the French drain is brand new, it won't drain its best because you cut off the roots of the sod and then you laid it back over the fabric. So we put these blind inlets in place and we just let the grass grow right over them and let them disappear. No maintenance. And at that point, once they're gone, everything's fully rooted. The system works its best. I had a family that had a small farm reach out to me. And they said, hey, we want to use high octane on our, on our farm. And it was a small family farm. They said, we're not going to put this pipe in with a tile plow. It was a couple acre farm. So they wanted to put high octane in. And they were going to follow the Boffman Tile Company's recommendations that this pipe has to be set in by hand. Because when Boffman Tile built the high octane and they opened it up over 17 square inches. Look at these inlets. Over 17 square inches per linear foot of inlet. They did two things. One, they said this is a yard drain pipe, a foundation pipe, crawl space pipe, where you're gonna be installing it and setting it by hand. Not mechanically with giant farm equipment. Because when you remove this much material from the sidewall of a pipe, there's not as much material in between the inlets. So the big giant tractors could possibly, although the jury's out on this, and I feel this could be put in with a tractor and there would be no damage to it. But having said that, we have to tell people this is a pipe that you set in by hand. So this family wanted to do their, their farm with high octane. And they said, we really don't want to have to do the burrito wrap. Well, I said, you know, that's what I endorse. I mean, you want everything to, to function properly. And as you know, ag doesn't always use stone. Matter of fact, most of the time they don't use stone at all. Then I had a crawl space encapsulation company call me and say, hey, when we're under these houses in Michigan, look, these crawl spaces aren't in feet as far as the room we have, like two, three feet. There's no feet. They have inches. And they said, we don't have room to burrito wrap our French drain or freedom drain. They said, we're lucky if we can get enough dirt out to get a pipe in with some stone on it. So guess what? We answered the needs of that crawl space encapsulation company, that family that wants to tile their small farm and handset high octane. We went ahead and we had high octane put in a sock for the special situations where you need the sock because maybe you don't want to put the stone in again you're tiling you know a big yard you just want to run a bunch of tile so yes there's so many ways to drain yards fields commercial properties sports fields the list is long if you're going to use high octane on a sports field with sand Use the high octane in a sock. We're here to meet everybody's needs. We listen, and then we get the job done. We deliver. So we now have high octane in a sock. 
Matter of fact, right after I shoot this video, I'm going to put it up in our online store. All right, everybody. Until that next video.